The internet, a network of computers that brings the world to your fingertips. But the World Wide Web also potentially brings you and your sensitive personal information to the fingertips of cyber criminals. If you think of the internet as a vacant house with secret tunnels where the windows and doors don't really lock, would you leave anything valuable there? No way. That is why taking steps to safeguard your important personal information is the best way to enjoy the resources of the internet while staying clear of potential threats. Cybersecurity threats can be classified into several categories. Viruses, worms, and Trojan horses are all types of malicious software programs designed to destroy or harvest your data or allow a cyber intruder to take over your machine. Phishing is the practice of using fake websites or email accounts to lure someone to provide personal information. Spyware is software that infects your computer and transmits your personal information to a third party without your consent. Spammers find your email account and fill your inbox with bogus messages and offers. So what are the risks? Cyber attackers could harvest your personal information to open credit card accounts, drain your bank accounts, or steal and sell your identity. Your computer could also become useless due to certain virus infections. Hackers exploit weak passwords to gain access to your computer and online accounts. The three main categories of hackers are white hat hackers, gray hat hackers, and black hat hackers. Black hat hackers are normally responsible for creating malware, Trojan horses, or using phishing methods to infiltrate computerized networks and systems. They're usually motivated by personal or financial gain, but can also participate in espionage, protests, or merely enjoy the thrill. White hat hackers, also known as ethical hackers, they're often employed or contracted by companies and government entities. They work as security specialists looking for weakly secured gateways into a network. Gray hat hackers utilize aspects of black and white hat hackers but will usually seek out vulnerabilities in a system without an owner's permission or knowledge. Here are some ways to limit hackers from accessing your information. You should also take steps to protect your data stored on your machine. Properly managing your online passwords is another layer of protection from cyber attackers. Be aware of phishing scams. Avoid opening email attachments or links from untrusted sources. It's also good practice to change your email password every three months. Starting in 2020, the Kentucky Department of Education will require education professionals to change email passwords every 120 days. Remember, always protect your data and avoid risky online behavior. Cybersecurity is everyone's responsibility. Be digitally careful online. Ignore or delete anything that seems strange and different from normal workflow. Always keep your computer and passwords secure. Last year, workplaces lost $11 billion to cybercrime. Do your part so the Kenton County School District is not part of this year's cybercrime statistics. And remember, in Kenton County, it's about all kids.